Hi, how are you? <laughs> Mr. Chonky Pupper, what is your opinion on Sonic? Yes. <laughs> I'm also curious, you know, like, I remember back when I was doing furry info stuff, a lot of people wanted me to answer, like, what are your thoughts on Mer suits? Like, controversial stuff. Now, folks want to ask questions of, like, what is your opinion on this character? As if, like, it's somewhat controversial. Or, like, my opinion will change the, the, the flow of the universe forever. I don't understand that. I don't understand that. It's like, what is your, what are your thoughts on fursuits? What? Huh? What does that mean? What does that mean? What are you going to gain from my answer? <laughs> what, what, what will be gained from the answer from this? I feel like anytime I answer anything, like, it's about as much depth as one of those magic eight balls. You know, if you're asking for my opinions on, like, Sonic, it's basically like shaking a magic eight ball. It means nothing. <laughs> Maybe that's what I should do. Whenever a question like that is asked, I get out a magic eight ball and then I give you an answer based on the magic eight ball. Okay, magic eight ball. Let's see if there's something if I could do. Oh, we have a website for it. Okay, okay, okay. So to answer your question, Beta, what are your thoughts on Sonic? Better not tell you now. There you go. My thoughts on Sonic the Hedgehog. <laughs> It's just like the same thing as like, hey, Beta, where can I find furry conventions? Sometimes there's a furry convention in Seattle. Sometimes there's not. That's a valid answer. It's the same thing as like, hey, Beta, can I have any advice on doing YouTube? If your poop is green, you should see a doctor. Valid advice for YouTube. See, see what I mean? Like, what I want to do is use this as an opportunity to have you guys ask questions with a bit more depth. I'm not saying questions like that aren't allowed, but I can also answer in a manner that makes sense in that sense. I'm also not like bashing anyone who's asking those questions, you know? I'm just more so simplifying the process of asking those questions. So right there, when you just asked me opinions on Sonic the Hedgehog, where are furry conventions, advice as a YouTuber, you just gave me three different videos that I can answer right there, put on my shorts channel. You just gave me three days of content. Thank you so much. You're amazing. You're are wonderful. How is Among Us funny? Why is Among Us funny? Can someone tell me that? I'm kind of curious now because I see it a lot in my like YouTube chats, my YouTube premiere chats. It's just Among Us or Among Us. It sounds like the most like elementary school like meme possible because it's not funny. It's What's overdone. Up? How's life going? How's life going? I'm asking about why Amogus is funny. Why is Amogus, like, Among Us funny? I know there's the whole meme of, like, stop posting Among Us. That's still kind of funny. But, like, why is it funny? Why do I see it, like, all the time on the internet, specifically with the younger crowd? I'm curious. Among Us is entering cringe culture. It, it already is. I thought it was. I'm just curious, because I see it all the time just pop up in my videos, in my streams, specifically my YouTube premiere chat. And when I see that spammed a lot, usually I tie it to some very elementary school level humor. Like, you know how the Vor thing was overdone? It's kind of in that territory. And granted, Vor is getting a bit of, you know, maturity in the sense of like, you know, I understand when you guys can use it properly. But like Among Us, Among Us, it just, it sounds like one of those overused things that children tie to because they still think it's funny. You know how there are memes for kids? It feels like it's one of those, but it's just obnoxious now to the rest of the world. Is the, is what I'm saying making sense? Also, you can enjoy Amogus if you want. I'm just saying. But it's one of those things where it feels extremely overdone. I'm allowed to have my opinions and you're still allowed to enjoy it. This is not me impeding on your own level of entertainment. <laughs> just so you know. Amogus is Peppa Pig for tweens. Oh my god. Oh, I don't want to think about it that way. Look, Peppa Pig, the meme, still pretty okay. It's okay. Oh my god, you know what it's like? It's like the Hey Beater meme. That was overdone so bad like I a year ago. Ratioed by Rolk. <laughs> ratioed by Rolk. Look, I still haven't done that raid yet. I gotta play Destiny 2 and I gotta do that raid. I also want some armor from that raid because I don't have any good rolls on it. I don't know. It sounds more like child. It sounds more childish than Peppa Pig. Like, guarantee, if I go into Explore YouTube Gaming right now, I'm going to find some sort of Among Us meme video. It's like borderline in the YouTube kids territory. Yep, yep, here we are. I found it. I was right. Trend. Why is this trending? Who's still playing this game? A married mod in Among Us. What does that do? What would that do to anything? How is that fun? Oh my god. What? 
single to married and it's trending who is watching this i'm gen i want to see the comments who is this that he scares me wait is that shaggy kind of looks like shaggy from a live action movie hold on top comments don't mean shit i'm browsing by newest let's let's see let's let's see what are these i was expecting more amogus spam what is it these seem like actual accounts fortnite mod. <laughs> I was expecting more Amogus memes in the chat, in like the, the comments. Oh, wait, nope, nope. Yeah, this is childish comments. Please, pretty please, look at your comments. <laughs> You know, a lot of these accounts remind me of, like, kids that take their parents' account because they can't actually have their own account. So it's just, you know, whatever their parents' name is, but the kid's commenting it. Am I the only one that looks at this when you see just the letters and the names? Like, look at this! <laughs> There's a lot more no profi profile pictures than profile pictures. Hey, I think the biggest red flag for me, the fact that Among Us is more of, like, a childish, very kid, kid, kid-friendly meme, is that the comments on a, an Among us video released today a majority of the comments are from accounts that don't have profile pictures i think that is the biggest red flag not having a profile picture have to do with anything well most of the time if kids are on youtube they won't make their own account they'll usually just use their parents email or whatever signed in on their tablet or phone like here here, here little timmy just take your ipad take my ipad go go enjoy that go go do your thing i'm gonna watch this movie i'm gonna i'm gonna watch this is us yeah, I'm gonna do that. Uh, you leave me alone. And like, this is the result. What are, what, hold on. Have I fucked my recommended now? Am I only gonna be recommended among us because I clicked on this video? God damn. Well, when in doubt, we've already got, I spent 50 hours in solitary <laughs> confinement <laughs> among us. <laughs> Hate a win in among us. Yeah, cause that's what we need. <laughs> See, that's what my recommended is screaming at me now just because I clicked on this video. Just because I clicked on this video means now that, yes, my recommended is fuck. Also, should we try this now? Mods, can you do me a favor? Ban the word Amogus. Ban the word Amogus. Just ban it. This is like what we're trying a thing like we did when we banned the word Protogen or any other any other version of that word. If you ban the word Amogus, I want to see if the quality of life of chat grows a little bit. <laughs> As in random accounts don't just show up after three messages and say that. No, no, Proto's fine. Protogen's fine. Keep the word Protogen. Just Amogus, Amogus. You can keep the word sus. Because that's just commonly used a lot more. But take away that word. Let's see what happens for the next week. We're trying it again. <laughs> Is this the content of the day? I banned Among Us in my Twitch stream. <laughs> Look, I'm just saying, maybe maybe the YouTube trending tab might not be the worst thing in the world. Because if we go to explore, I can just look here in the trending or gaming tab and be like, oh, what's some trending stuff right here that I should ban as words in my stream? But either way, are we under the conclusion that Amogus or Among Us, the meme, is dead and that it's only really used by children? Not that there's anything wrong with children using it. I mean, it's got to go somewhere. But at the same time, I don't want it thrown in my face all the time. I think that's absolutely fair. If I don't want my chat to just be Amogus, like my YouTube premiere chat, let me see if I can bring it up. Hold on. I haven't actually showed you guys this. So let's go to my recent video. Let me see if I can bring up premiere chat to show you what a mess it is. You want to see what I've evolved? from well here let me show you let me show you so this is the video and the premiere chat is like twitch chat here but it's youtube users this is an absolute nightmare so i'm gonna mute everything because the video itself doesn't matter look at look at chat just oh ooh woos oh woes counting more counting i expected more amogus gibberish ooh woos it stopped where's chat come on usually this is a, a bit more spammy than i thought see 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 play change special edition play change special play change spe see see kids are on another level why do you why why do you have your mother's ipad <laughs> See what I mean? And I think they were like timed out after this. I can't remember. Omen G, you're watching YouTube videos from beta SMH. You're gonna get a copyright strike. <laughs> but like, I think more so the point was if you just pay attention to it, usually the people in chat 
are a lot of, what's the word, child accounts where they steal their parents' iPad or their parents' iPad is given to them, which is an example. Like, here's the thing. Most of my chat is the uwus. It's your mom here asking me to play a certain game. Uwu and Owo spam, random counting, people leaving the alphabet as spam in the chat, um, talking about their fursona in chat, amplified to 11. It's those people amplified to 11. That is YouTube premiere chats end up being. And I know Zenith, you can absolutely relate with that. Here's just like the big thing. The humor of like doing the Owo, Uwu in the chat it's just noise. That's not more so my point of just being like, children are problematic, they shouldn't be on the internet. But at the same time, it's like, it's one of those things where it's like, okay, maybe we don't want my chat to just be spam of oh woe, ooh woo, play changed. Hey beta, my fursona is this. <laughs> you know? Like, I, I can't be wrong with this feeling, right?